Urban Gardening Thailand here. Welcome back. It's December in Thailand and I found a big beautiful achiote tree and as you can see it's in bloom. Look at all these big beautiful red pods. We're going to be taking some of these pods that have opened up and taking the seeds out and planting them and see if we can get some achiote plants. And here's an achiote pod that has opened up and you can see all the red seeds inside. I've let the seed pods dry out for a few more days. Just how many seeds are in a pod? Let's find out. One pod had 45 seeds and the other had 50. Wow, that's a lot. Now let's try to grow them. I'm planting four seeds in each container as I'm not sure of their viability. Um, the seeds are used to make anato paste, which is used in cosmetics and cooking. So the tree is also known as the anato tree and anato seeds. Another common name is the lipstick tree due to the color of the seeds. I'm going to cover the seeds with a thin layer of sand. Though I think using regular soil is just fine too. I will bring these in at night if the temperature drops below 25 degrees Celsius, 78 degrees Fahrenheit. It's been 10 days and the first seed has just started to sprout. It's been 16 days now. These are what the cotyledons look like. It's been 30 days now and I have some very interesting and unexpected results to share with you. I divided the containers into two groups. This group on the right is from seeds from burst pods that had fallen on the ground. I believe Anato achiote seeds are quite prone to fungal rot and other problems with them and none of these seeds grow. On the left, we have seeds taken from burst pods that were still on the tree. And as you can see, they almost all grew. I think I've got about an 80% success rate here. If you're in a warm climate, I don't think Anato achiote seeds are that difficult to grow. However, it is really, really important that you get viable seeds. So there you have it. I'll leave notes in the description below. Comments and a like would be appreciated. Happy gardening and we'll see you next time. Bye.